What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you 20 to 25 useful terminal commands that you should know. If you're a programmer, you know these already. If you don't know them, if you're new to programming, new to coding, new to terminal, then these 25 commands are so useful. So without further ado, let's start the video. Okay, CD means change directory. Now you're back into your home directory. If I do LS, I get a list of everything. If I do LS minus L, I get everything in a list. If I do clear, it clears the whole terminal. If I do, let's make a directory. Okay, where do we want to go now? LS, let's go to the desktop. LS minus L. Let's make a directory called make a directory called trial or whatever. Now if we do ls minus l, then we have a directory also called trial. Okay, now I'll change directory and go into that directory. Clear that out. In case you're wondering how did I get so fast, how did I type trial so fast? Type T and type tab and it auto does it itself. Okay, so print working directory shows you what directory you're in now. Let's remove the directory rm but before we do that go back one cd space dot dot takes you back a directory ls minus self i'm on the desktop now if i do rm it says it's directory rm that's deleted now if i do ls minus self Trial is gone. Clear that all out. Okay, I've made the directory again. So now I'm going to change into it. And I'll do a touch. That's another command. Prog1. Dot C. If I do nano, that's another command. It's a text editor. I can start editing a program in this file. So let's do hashtag include. stdio.h int main. Return zero. Close that off. Control X to save it. Y and then enter. And now another command is cat. Prog one onto the screen. Just shows your program onto the screen. And to compile this, you need GCC. Prog one minus O. Prog one again. Get rid of that. Press enter. That should compile it. And the next command I'll do is to show you how to run that program. Dot slash prog1. There you go, that's my name. I should have put a new line in. So if I do nano. Control XY. Enter. Recompile that if I go up. If I do up again, and there you go, Rehan Abdullah. Okay, what else do I want to do? If I want to, where am I at now? LS. Okay, if I do open minus A, J edit, and the program's name. And then JEdit should open with the program with prog1.c. There you go. Okay, I'm going to close this now.
Okay, now if I do CD, it takes me back to the home directory. If I do clear, that gets rid of it. Now if I do CD, desktop, trial, semicolon, LS minus L. I went from one directory to another and listed everything in that directory just from one command on the terminal. Okay, if I want to screen capture this, screenshot this, I do the command is screen capture minus X minus T JPG because that's what the photo will be. That's the format of the screenshot code.jpg. And there you go. Now, if I do open, there you go. The file has opened. The preview screenshot. Okay, so if I do cd dot dot slash dot dot, it took me back to the home directory. If I also do CD, clear that all out. Where am I now? Okay, so if we do go to the CD downloads, see what's in there. Okay, if I want to move the CV called CV Rehan Abdullah, I can do MV tilde, which is alter N and then slash desktop. If I go to CD There you go, C C V Rayhan Abdullah has moved to the desktop. If I do clear, all of it goes away. If I do exit, we will leave the terminal. There you go, we are logged out now. That's it for this programming 20 to 25 useful terminal commands video tutorial. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Thanks for now.